Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to learn how to configure workspace in Team Foundation Server 2015 using Visual Studio 2015. When we talk about uh, configuring uh, workspace, what it means is that uh, you go in Team Foundation Server, or uh, you wanted to work on a certain project, and um, you wanted to look at the solution of that project. When you double click on the solution in Team Foundation Server, uh, then it asks you that you need to download everything about that project, all the solution and all the components uh, uh, connected to that solution to your local repository. Otherwise, you can't start your uh, development. So in this video, we'll learn how to configure our local repository and connect with Team Foundation Server so we can start our development. Um, I have Visual Studio Enterprise, as you can see right here, Enterprise 2015. And this is how it looks like when I'm connected with my Team Foundation Server. As you can see on the right side, if you hover your mouse on Team Foundation Server, it'll give you a um, complete path of your uh, Team Foundation Server connection using Visual Studio. So in my case, I have a Team Foundation Server. I'm connected with default collection and Tech Brothers TFS. Um, Tech Brothers team is my team project. So. Uh, again, there are multiple ways to uh, configure your workspace. If you are connected with your Team Foundation first time using Visual Studio, you might see these options right here. First option right here is configure your workspace. You can click on that. Uh, but if you have cl uh, clicked here, don't prompt again, this might not appear. So the other way that you could do under project, you will see that configure workspace. If you have already workspace configured, then it will not show that. But easier way to do it really is if you're using different um, versions of uh, Visual Studio. In my case, it's, as I said, it's enterprise, but it might these things might not appear um, in your other versions of um, Visual Studio like it's appearing for me. Um, but uh, if you open uh, Source Control Explorer, you double click on that, you will see that uh, Team Foundation Server default collection right here and team project right here tech brothers in my case so you will see your team project right here and on local path if you notice it says not mapped this is where you need to uh, click so i'm going to click on not mapped and now it's asking your local folder where you want to save the uh, tech brothers team solutions so i'm going to give a local path in my case i'm going to provide the local path and click OK under sources. Um, this is the local path that that where um, my solution will be downloaded and then I can start my development. Click on map. And it says newly mapped items will not be downloaded until you execute uh, a get. Uh, do you want to get you? You have an option to click no and then you need to right click and say get that that'll what get will do is um, It'll download all the solution components to your local repository so that you can start your work. So I'm going to click yes. As you can see that now I can see my local path right here and I can st start my development. Basically, this is it. This is how you configure your workspace and now you can start your um, development from here. And I hope this video helps.